Hello, my friends. It's been a hot titty minute and welcome back to Let's Build Newcrest. Of the first part of Newcrest Church, um, my second time building it because as you know, my PC did a massive fart and died and I was really pissed off of it to be truthful because I did a whole build plus recorded the videos. I've, I've told you, I don't need to fucking go over it again. <laughs> I've told you what happened. I'm doing my own head in. I thought I'd go about this build a little bit differently in the way that I did beforehand. Um, last time I'd built a huge church. It was okay. It was me. I'd give it a six out of 10. This time I'm going to build a smaller church, but maybe do like an outdoor market. Um, and then what I'll do is you can then change this lot type to generic or retail. So you can sw swap the lot type over and they will both work properly. I thought that would be a good way about doing it, darlings. So the church is going to be predominantly for marriage. Marriage. <laughs> um, yeah, the church is going to be predominantly for getting your sims married, etc, etc. And the market is going to be for retail. I thought that would be a lovely way to go about it. Now, before we go along, my hair is different. Yes, it is. I got a bit pissed off with the blonde. It's not true. Blondes don't have more fun. You're all fucking lying. I have much more fun when I'm a brunette. <laughs> um, so I've coloured it. It's a mess. I, I usually get my hair cut every four weeks. This is the six weeks mark. So this is why I'm wearing it in its natural curly form because it's the only way it will ever do anything that looks half decent. Um, with that announcement, let's move on. <laughs> ah, fucking, I'm doing my own head in already. Right, I have no idea we're going to go and do this, but we're going to crack on. I'm thinking maybe putting the church here, having the, a little moment in the front. Oh, that's maybe a little bit too far back, just because I do want to have a graveyard and a wedding kind of area over here. And this is where the market will be. Yes, I think so. I think so. Now that we've got the new pack as well and the new windows, we might be able to do something fancy smancy with the new window types. Um, I'm just going to build this bit first and see what we can do in the front here. I know that I'll probably do an archway here, I would imagine. Um, can't remember if there's any two. Oh, what? What in the Christ? I haven't even got my cheeks on either. That's disgusting. Move objects on. Where's this? Is this from the free update? I think it is. It's from the free update. Well, we're going to be slapping that in. I tell you that much, sweethearts. Oh, that's pretty. I've not even seen this. Not even seen this. No greys? No? No, don't want a grey? Okay, great. Yeah, don't want a grey. Don't want a grey. Uh, that one there's the prettiest what I've seen so far. It's not that big though, is it? Not that big. Hmm. I know this one here is taller. But that's more churchy. Oh, maybe I could do something with the windows with this. Can we raise this up? If I raised it, maybe, and do a plain swatch, so the as nice as that swatch is, it's gorgeous, but I could maybe slap in. Um, Absolutely not, no. Oh, that looks stupid. Well, that's out the window. I'm thinking maybe trying to do something with the windows with this, though. We'll keep it there for the minute. We'll keep it there for the minute, so anyway. Where was I before I get distracted and start farting all over the room? Um, I'm thinking this little like main entrance area here, maybe a toilet into this side and a little vicar's room onto this side. I do want to make this very symmetrical. So if this might not appeal to me in the slightest because I'm not a fan of symmetrical builds unless they're done exquisitely. I love that word. I love that word. I ho hope, hope. <laughs> I hope you're all doing well. I hope you've all had um, an amazing time. <laughs> um, I, I don't know why I'm laughing. I think it's because I forgot what I was going to say. I just hope that you've all had a good time while I've been away. I know there's plenty more people out there for you to choose from where you can flop on down and watch their content. But I'm glad that you came to me. You all came back to me. I appreciate it. I really do kind of want to use these windows do they come in a oh okay so these are like kind of to match in with it. I, I get you i knew that these windows were here do want to use these now though um maybe doing in that they're pretty yeah i like that i do like that okay a little pillar there another little window moment a little pillar there 
Another little window moment. Little pillar there. Stunning. Stunning. I'm here for it. Absolutely. Um, but, yeah. Sorry that this uh, uh, project... Is it a project? Can you call? Can you call building a new Crystal project? It kind of is. I'm sorry that this kind of took a back seat for a while. Um, I'm, I'm not going to close that in there, actually. I'm going to open it up here. Um, yeah, sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> but I'm back and it's going to be great. Right, and we'll go to there. I'm not doing a penis or cross shape on purpose. I promise you. Oh, Oh, what went on there then? How come this is odd? Oh, hang on. Oh, okay, right, if I can just do this then. To there. To there. To you, to you. And if I shuffle this in, like so, darlings. How did I do that? I bet someone was like, what are you, oh, what am I copying it for? Um, there was someone was like, Aiden, what are you doing? Aiden. Aiden, you're making a mistake. There we go. There. That's not right either. <laughs> oh, it's because this is out now. <laughs> I was like, that looks a bit squiffy. That looks a little bit squiffy. This is a bit big, but I'm going to go with it. Um, I'm not going to do any. I'm going to do another, like, roof line here. But I'm not going to kind of have access up there. I'll probably make it, like, double story height with big chandeliers and whatnot. Um... But what I will be doing is a tower of some description in the front. So let's get that on first. Is it going to be too small being a too wide one? It might be all right. Maybe one more on top. Yeah, I think so. I do believe so. Okay. And then over to here. This may look very basic in the beginning, but I find with churches is... It's mainly the detail part that gets added in uh, after. Okay, right, let me... Yeah, the detail part gets added in after and it really makes a difference that way. In my personal experiences with building churches. Churches. But um, we'll get to going back to the residential area after this um, bit. This build, sorry. I am unsure how long this build will take. Could be two parts, could be three parts. I am unsure... But yes. Okay. Mm, okay, right. And then I'm going to do a half wall on these. Let me just see what size this is first. Okay, that should do, I think. Yep, you to there. 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 And again on these sides. I could just copy them. It's a lot easier. But I always build the original way of building. And sometimes it's hard to get out of habits. Yeah, I think so. I do believe so. Um, I might even come in on these now that I'm looking at it just to add a bit of a dynamic aspect to the build. If I can do this and this there and just pull that in maybe. If I do that to there, there. And then I can pull these actually in and it just adds a little bit more dynamic and stops the back from looking like a flat mess. Yes. Okay. These are going to have... Uh, roofs on them. I'm thinking actually, maybe moving this along. Should I do it both sides? No, we'll do it just one side and then push that one in. Yeah, I think we'll do it that way. So I'll push this over to this side, this one in here, and you in there. Like so. Okay. Yeah, I kind of feel that. That is not a bad first shape. For what we're going to go for for this build anyway. Okay, well, let's start getting the roof on. See what we're going to be doing with this first. I'm thinking... In fact... Hmm... Maybe... Maybe not going right up to there, but going to here. And then where is it going to end? It ends there, doesn't it? So maybe another roof line there. And then pulling a... Uh... Uh, half gabled across. Let's have a little look. See what we can do with this. I do want it to be quite rounded, I think. Unsure at what... Um, yeah, I think so. Right, okay. And then getting this on here. Excuse you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much indeed. If I pluck you to there and then pull you up quite... Quite high. 
Hmm. Not keen on this shape just yet, but I will morph this around slightly. Is that going to have one of those weird white lines through it? I don't think so. I don't think so. So let me pull this out all the way to the tucking in those ends now, maybe. Or should we keep going with that? Unsure yet. We're going to be doing like a half wall moment here anyway. It might make that look a little bit more castly. Could be the word of this build. A bit castly. Um, yeah, maybe. Right. Then a shift and C with this. And let me just try and morph this shape just to make it a bit more churchy. Churchy and castly. Yeah, that's better. That's giving me a bit more of a sweetheart kind of vibe to it. And maybe just point rounding out the top to this one. Mm, maybe do a shift C with, oh, here, just rounding out the top. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's fine. And again, with this side, I'll just copy this straight over to this way. Um, Like so. Oh, I pressed M. <laughs> Probably because I'm saying M. Like M. Oh, there it is. It's pressing. <laughs> what a tit. What an absolute boob. Right, okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Might even come up another level with this. Yeah, I think I'm going to, you know. I think I'm going to come up another little cheeky level here. Just a short one. Yeah, that's cool. Okay. Okay. Now, with this roof line here, this is going to be quite difficult. I'm thinking maybe doing a half-hipped. Oh, I could even face the half-hipped this way. And then marry in the shape from the roof there. <laughs> that could be glorious. Let's see what this is going to look like. Could be awful. We will know in T minus two biscuits. Um, mm, not keen on how that looks like that, but I could just pull these out just on either side here. And that kind of hides that. Oh, that's cute. Oh, I didn't do it on this one. What a boob. I kind of like that. I'm, do you know what? Kind of here for that. I'm absolutely kind of here for it. Okay. Okay, well, that was predominantly easy. Wondering if I should come out a bit more here now. Thinking I may. I might just take it straight here. Because I quite, I love the way that that looks, that roof line. Um, so it might look okay being pulled straight from there. Yeah, it does. Okay. Ooh, just had a thought as well. Maybe. Let's get the grid on down there. Maybe if I can do a moment. If you hear snoring, it's my pup. He's lying next to me. Dreaming the day away. I'm a bit tired at the minute. Um, I've just done an, an hour of yoga and I feel a bit exhausted from it, to be honest with you. Relaxed, replenished, but exhausted. Um, I'm putting like a half wall here. Maybe the smallest of half walls just to frame in there. No, that looks awful because the roof line pokes through it. Um, maybe not going across there. Oh, did I get rid of that then? No, I didn't. There we go. Yeah, that's fine. There's this weird thing with a minute with like roof lines. When you put half walls to it, it makes the roof clip out really funny. Again, probably another bug that we'll have for another thousand years. Why The Sims 4 is still in production. Um, because there's so many bugs at the minute. More so than usual. I don't know if anybody else like agrees with me, but there just seems to be more bugs than usual, especially with build mode. Like, I just, I'm not a fan. I'm not a fan of it. Yeah, if I can do that there and then go ahead and do one of these just here. Uh, let's pull you straight out there, love. And then tuck your flaps in. Ooh, uh, tuck your flaps in, sweetie. Your flaps are showing, darling. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's not, I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, I think so. Maybe not, actually. What if I pull this into there and just have the... Ah, oh, I can't because it's inside. Okay. Um, is there not going to be no... Oh, gosh. Uh, there's no, like underneath there oh, i suppose because i didn't really tuck any kind of flooring in okay well i'll put this to like there did that just get rid of that roof then no it didn't uh do i want to take that all the way along to get a trim moment no i think that'd be okay oh 
What's going on here? What's going on here? I think I just had my dog fart. So if I faint at any minute, it's because I've breathed in his fumes and died. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, hang on. Is there a wall missing from there now? That's why. Why did this disappear? Is it because I put that weird? And the roofs are picking th poking through again. Oh, for God's sake. See what I mean? Like, the, why has this not been sorted? The room system with roofs poking in. Ugh. I've, I've seen a few other builders get really annoyed of it lately. And I'm one of them. Yeah, I think so. Let me just get this page up. Okay, I'm unsure what kind of roof line I want on top of this church. I would have done a castle wall, but being kind of two square wide, it doesn't really make sense doing it that way. Um, Another half gabled onto these edges here. I'm thinking... Oh, maybe I could ground this down. I've just had a little... I've had a little epiphany. If I can kind of bring you to there. Tuck that flap in again. Giggity. Bring you to there. Let me just see what this would look. Oh, God. Oh, it's too steep. It's because there's a medium wall, isn't it? I can bring it up to this way, but that might be a little bit too big now. Pull that flap down there. Let me just raise this ever so slightly so we don't get that weird line. This is three wide, which is what I wanted. And then maybe if I do two of these and then put a little church window in the middle of them. Mm, that's made it look a little bit more modern. And I'm not kind of here for that for this build. Could be a cool idea to build a modern church, though. Maybe that's something I could do in the future. I think this is fine. When I saw this light line, when I saw the shape, I was like, that is fine. But I just wanted to test something. Um, Maybe just tucking you in there and then bringing you out in the middle. Just for a bit of dynamic. Yes. And then I'll copy this. Place this onto this side over here. Um, and yeah. I think what I'm going to do now is I'm going to start choosing some wallpapers. Um, and what I've decided to do with that is kind of keeping that off camera and then showing you the palette of what I've chosen. Um, it just saves a bit more time. Stops the video for being six hours long. See you in just a second. Okay, so this is the palette we're going to go for. These are the kind of windows I think that I want to use. Did want to use the bigger window in this version on the kind of main back of the church, but it doesn't fit kind of perfectly. So we're going to go for this. And I think I'm going to go and put that on the front there as well. But these um, wallpapers work really well together. I think this is from Island Adventure. And this is the new one we've got in the pack update. I love the detail on the edges of this. I think that's why I wanted to go for this. It does look a little, again, does look a little bit semi-modern. But I'm kind of here for it. I'm going to do it and everything's going to be all right in the world. And we're just going to pull through this together, hold hands and maybe kiss. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't know where that come from. <laughs> don't kiss me. I have a boyfriend. <laughs> um, yeah, I think this one. This, again, being annoying and not putting the columns where I want them to be. But we're going to go for it. We're going to go for it. We're going to do it. It's going to be great. I will do some accents in the other stone because it does work really well with this color way. Um, we shall see. We shall see. Let's get inside those pillars, my loves. Let's flop ourselves right inside them. Um, wondering if I should do the pillars in stone or the back in um, the brick. Let's have a look. Let's have a little goosey gander. Kind of feel them. Mm, let's have a look. I was going to do this whole, the whole thing like this in that stone as well, which I think works really nicely. I can see an uncolored bit of wallpaper in there and it's really pissing me off. There we are. Excuse you. Lovely. Let's just like copy all of that. There we go. Lovely. Um, yeah, I think so. I do think so. I don't think this one goes on there. No, it doesn't. Okay. Yeah, I think that's going to be okay. Let's have a little goose. So a very grey church, but I do want lots of colour with the stained glass windows. I'm unsure. I didn't test this out in gameplay, but with the stained glass windows, does the light shine through in colour? I would be very interested to know this for homework purposes. 
Oh god, I've missed one out there as well. Look. Yeah, I'd be interested to know that. I don't know if anybody else, anybody knows that out there. But we will, we'll find out together anyway. Um, am I done here? I think so. Obviously, we need to change those wall trim colours and get some roof trims and stuff on. Yeah, I think so. So we're going to keep these pillars in this. I think that would be a good idea. I know I've coloured them, but I just wanted to make sure before I went ahead. Yeah, I do like them in this stone. Gorgeous colourway with this stone as well. That grey is just perfect grey. It's not blue. It's just a nice charcoal -y, powdery grey. And I'm here for it. And I'm going to marry it. <laughs> God. God, Jeebus. There we are. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it will be fine. It will be fine. I do believe so. Right, okay. So this one here, my thoughts were having it like here. Like just above the doorway there. And then obviously we're going to do a clock at the top here. Ooh. Shall I, can I widen this at the top? Would it look weird if I did that? Yes, it bloody would. I just think it's a little bit skinny now. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Just carry on. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> um, I wanted to use these. But I also wanted to use them. Let's have a look, see what looks better. I'm going to lay these along. So maybe to that level. We'll put some trims and that on it as well. So don't you worry. Don't you worry your little bonnets over this, my loves. It's not going to be even because of that. But oh well. Let's have a see. Kind, I'm really feeling at the minute putting like warmer toned woods. Like this orangey wood. And I do it in my bedroom, for instance. Um, with grey. I love seeing the juxtaposition, juxtaposition the juxtaposition between the warmer wood and the paler cool tones of a grey. I enjoy it. Some people might not like it but I do. And this is my build so we'll leave it at that. <laughs> um, yeah I think so. Maybe I could do these out the front here. No. No absolutely not. But I'd hmm. Or do we want these here? No. No, I don't think so. I don't think so, no. I think we'll stick with the same windows. I do like them. We'll make them look a lot more interesting as well with... Uh, with some, like, details on the walls and stuff around it. I think that would be quite pretty. Quite pretty indeed. Yeah, I do kind of feel that. Kind of feel that. So, this is where we were stuck. My thoughts were... Doing this so kind of shape, one down, one up like that. And then doing the big circle, or not the big circle window because it won't fit in there, but this circle window. Smack bang in the center. Let's have a little goose at what that would look like on the inside. I haven't got my mods on, so I can't go into cam mode in build mode, which is infuriating. Um, oh, that's pretty. Do I put two more windows next to it? I think I might, you know. Let's have a look at what that looks like. <sighs> up please thank you maybe raising that yeah that's pretty full oh i enjoy that i do yeah i enjoy that okay right now let me color these wall trims and we're going to figure out what to put in here too might have to go into debug because i did use a lot of debug in my um build that i did beforehand i used a lot of the sort of roof pieces and stuff from debug so it might mean I have to go away for two seconds in a minute and find the stuff, the stuff that's needed. It looks a bit brown next to that grey now. Do you see what I mean? Like, I don't know if it's the lighting or... See, that looks completely fine now. Yeah, that looks fine. I hope the lighting is massively improved in The Sims um, 5. I really do. I really, really do. I've just had a thought. That's why I'm doing this here. Maybe I could... Oh, no, I've just thought it might not do that detail now. Yeah, it's not going to. We'll miss that detail there. We'll forget I did that. We'll forget I did that. Maybe I could, like, have a little moment. Um, Excuse you. Excuse you. Excuse you. Do we have a grey in this? No, we've got white, though. And there is white details in there. Oh, yeah, I feel this may work. Maybe just streaking it down one. Yeah. I'm putting these like here. Yeah. 
that would be cool. That just adds a little bit more sturdiness. And I just like the detail of the roof kind of being kind of overlapped there. I kind of like that. Yes. Okay. Okay. Right. I'm going to go into debug. See you in two biscuits. So I have decided to go for a chimney. I looked in debug and the things that I used last time just don't fit with this church. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a chimney in here. Unusable. I'm not going to put any fires in the church so they won't start smoking and looking weird. Um, it just adds in a little bit of architectural detail. And these, uh, they're called a roof vent. I don't, I don't see how they're a roof vent, but okay. Finial roof vent. Oh, oh, maybe that's what they're called, a vent. A roof vent. I just thought they added quite a cute little bit of detail. Yeah. Um, and you can see I've also pulled out these um, sort of like roof pieces, what they called again. Uh, a dormer from the vampire stuff or the vampire game pack. And I've just plonked them as well. That might change, but for the minute, I'm okay with it. I think the one thing that will pull this build and make it look a lot more dynamic is some, is some pillars, my loves. Is some pillars. Now, we did get new pillars with the um, Realm of Magic game pack. I'm wondering if this will fit in with this build well. Um, that one's got gold now. I wish it didn't have gold on it. But the gold could pay respect to the fact that we are using with warmer woods but it doesn't really sit well with the warm wood mm, it's not too bad maybe i can kind of see the past that maybe i can't but we're going to try it anyway is it bougie is do we want to put them there as well mm, that might be a bit overkill because i am going to be laying it on these two and maybe in between the windows yes yes okay yeah we'll do that so we'll lay them on each edge of the pillar and in between the windows. Um, maybe I can put two here just to frame that in nicely. And I might want to put a window up here. Uh, unsure as of yet. So let's get that grid on, bring it down here and plonk these up this way. And do the same on the other side. It just adds in detail. That's all it does. And it just makes the build look a lot more sturdier, doesn't it? Yes, I'm kind of feeling that. Okay, we'll do it here too. Do I want to put them like in between? No, we'll keep that free. Um, oh, they would look good a bit in between these windows here though. Mm, it's not going to work, but they would look good there. They would, they'd look stunning, but they're not going to go there. We'll keep plonking this around. Okay, so that other side's done and then we'll come and we'll do it. Or oh, is that going to look weird with the... No, it looked fine. And then we'll do it on the tower as well. We'll do it all along the tower. And I will be using a uh, freeze as well. Unsure of what freeze we're going to be using yet, but we'll play around with a few. I do want it to look quite ornate. Uh, again, this is not going to fit into the world well, but tough tit. Tough tit. That's all I can say. Yeah. New Crest is not great if you want to build in a certain kind of style. You, you do have to stick with the same style and stuff. Mm, that pillars disappearing there but oh well yeah okay so far so good i think what we'll start doing is maybe plonking in a roof do we want to use this just normal i think we might and then maybe frame around with a half wall or something i don't think this is going to go very tall there um, oh do you know what it's not too bad it does look a little bit weird um maybe if i do a flat one underneath of it uh, if I can just bring this... Oh, gosh. What am I doing? Bring you down. And then... Frame this all the way along. Like, excuse you. There we are. And then if I can just shift this up just slightly. Again, shift and see this as well. Just so I can get a bend. What way would you go more? You would go more there. And then if I can just scoop you in. Huh. <laughs> That's not too bad. Let's have a look. <laughs> it looks like it's got a fucking witch's hat on. No, that looks stupid. That looks silly. We'll figure out something else. I think what I'll do is I'll pull this down just like that's not going to look weird as well. Uh, hmm, maybe like a half wall or a fence around there could be a good idea. Let's have a little look. Oh, my eyes are stinging. These contacts are not working well with me today. Um, 
let's have a little look at what size you would come out as oh gosh what what have i got selected here why I, did i select that i need a slap right across the cheek right there yeah do you come in a better tone i bet you don't no that's even darker we'll have to stick with this one is that the same one nope there we go um and don't forget we're doing freezes as well so and we're going to do a clock on the top there maybe some more windows maybe some more windows up on that bit and i can make this look a lot taller by putting in a uh a, a, a steeple are they called a steeple steeple a church is steeple that sounds right we're gonna go with that <laughs> Or I could use the same one what we've used down there, but size it up, maybe. Oh, in fact, you don't really need to with that. Yeah, that's going to give me impact. Okay. Yeah. It's still too small. I knew I'd have this problem because of how small the tower is. But I did want that to be a little bit larger. But we're going to keep that going. We're going to keep that flowing. And we're going to carry on and see what else we can get up to, shall we? Um, inside the church, I think having this stone all throughout it would probably work the best. We'll put them inside the pillars there as well. Um, and then we'll start choosing the freeze. Let me just get all this sorted in here. Same with you, darling. In here. And we're going to knock this floor out now as well. Just knock it right out. <laughs> Bye. Yeah, lovely. Oh, shit. I forgot about the... Hmm. Let's do that again. I'm going to put a little, a little fancy moment across here. What fence shall we use? Uh, this one's very churchy. Keeping the grey in. Oh, mate, bring it, mate. Hey, mate. It. I'll bring a bit of warmer wood on the inside, actually. And then we'll bash this is out there. And then I'll maybe put some stairs up there. And this can be like a little area where the choir comes and sings all their shit songs. <laughs> Uh, who knows? We'll get rid of that. We'll do that all the way around. Yeah. Okay. We'll choose the flooring in that in a sec. We'll do that in just a jiffy. Um, what I am going to do, actually, before I carry on with this, is I'm going to raise the church up some. So I can put some nice stairs on the outside as well. Uh, Foundation-wise, does this come in that grey? It doesn't, does it? Why bring a wallpaper out and not have the matching... <sighs> Sims team. It's like you need one of us just to come and to say, no, don't do that. Because I know how that would annoy people. That that doesn't match this and that doesn't match that. But no, they carry on as they were. <laughs> That's not too bad anyway. That's fine. We'll raise the train up to it as well so it won't be floating. And we're going to do a little moment in here. Um, this is obviously going to be the wedding and graveyard area. And this can be the market in front. Lovely. And a little area where the car can come in and drop off the bride. Stunning. Okay. So I was going to choose the freezes. My idea with the freeze was maybe trying to use one of these. But I know that they won't come in any kind of matching tone. Um, let me get this on at night. This is green, isn't it? But it ma it goes really well. Okay, that's a definite maybe. What other tones have we got here? That's a green. So what is this then? It's like a light green, isn't it? Is that green? Yeah, it is. It's like a mossy poo green. And I'm all for it. I'm here for it, to be honest. This is nice. As mm -hmm. That doesn't really marry in well on the front. There's no grey with that one either. I know this one comes in a grey. Um... That's quite pretty as well. I do like that with it. But again, look, the, the greys just sit weirdly. It sits fine with that. But as soon as you put it with this stone, because it's got a bit of depth to it, looks weird, looks blue. Not here for it. And that one's not going to marry it. I think this one's the winner. I really enjoy the way that that looks with the grey. I won't lie to you, my friends. Let's get it all the way around. I'm going to have to change the colour of those steeple bits now, though. I think in all the way around... Why is this not coming on on the inside? 
Stop being a shit. Okay. Oh, look at the weird that looks there now. I'll have to sort that out. I really enjoy the colours of this. And the columns are still disappearing as well, so another bug. Do they ever address the bugs? <laughs> Do they ever say, oh, this isn't working, sorry, we will fix it in 7,000 years? <laughs> um. Yeah. Not enjoying how that looks on the inside there. I would like it to come across straight across from here. So I think what I'm going to have to do actually is... Hang on a minute. Why are you not going there? There is a flooring. There's flooring right there. I can see it. You're just going to be an asshole, aren't you? What if I... Oh, I was going to get rid of all of that. Do you know what? We'll figure that out off the camera. I don't want to bore you guys with how this isn't working. But I hope it kind of humanizes the situation a little bit more. Everyone has difficult building, difficulty building. Oh, look at the windows poking through that now. I'm not enjoying that, to be honest. <laughs> I'm going to pull these down. I am. I'm going to pull them down. The freeze needed to take over the dominancy there a little bit more. Same with you. Let's bring you down too. Lovely. Yeah, I'm really enjoying that colorway. I'm enjoying the... Some people might not like the green with the gray, but I actually really do. Green with gray and gold. I think it's because it's got an undertone to gold in it as well, if you know what I mean. So it's kind of sitting with the pillars nicely. And also the warmer tones in the wood. Delicious. Right, okay. There we go. <sighs> Let's bring you all down to my level. The worst level. Um, There we go. Lovely. Stunning! Okay. Yeah, I'm for, I'm for it. For it. We're going to carry on. Don't think I'm going to be able to put that on top because it's not a medium wall. Uh, um, Maybe if I'd use the grey up there. Mm, needs to be bigger. Needs to be chunkier. Is that the right? That grey doesn't sit at all badly with the darker tone. Actually. Oh, it does. It looks weird. I don't know. Is it the lighting again? Yeah, it's the lighting. Yes, yeah, it's fine. Is that thing disappeared? Why is that disappeared? Why? Why are you closed? <laughs> um, yeah, I think that's fine. I think it's fine. Do you come? No, is the answer to that. Mm. It kind of sits fine with the black. Okay. Okay. Yeah, not too bad. I mean, we've made a start. I'm going to stop pulling the train up. We're going to pick the floor. We're going to put the stairs in. Might do something fancy with the stairs. See if we can maybe... Mm. Yeah, let's try and do something fancy with the stairs first. And then we'll pull the train up around it. Stair-wise, maybe using the either these ones... Let's have a little look at you, my sweet. I mean, that is a great colorway, but I hate that it doesn't come with like a chunky sort of side to it. That really annoys me. But I have found a way around that actually. So wait, hang on. Still haven't got used to doing these stairs. Not in the slightest. Still have not. I'm thinking maybe like a, if I can maybe, should I do it like this way or that way? I think that way. Oh, that looks stupid. <laughs> oh, it's because it's so short, the foundation, isn't it? It's not going to do anything. Yeah, the stairs are great and all. I really enjoy them. But I've still not found a way to sort of be an expert per se at them yet. These are the wrong stairs that I am using. I can't see for the life of me. Oh, they look great, actually. I like them. I like them a lot, my love. Um, no. It's because it's too short. I need to, you can only do those kind of L shapes when it's like sort of two levels, but I thought there would have been a way around that. Um, maybe if I move that to there, I don't know what you're doing. Get back. I don't hate that. I don't hate that. Let's start getting in some curved 
edges so I can put some nice fences around the church so it kind of looks fancy. Right, if I can do that to there. Bring it just in one, actually. And then if I just move this to there. Lovely. Yeah. And then same with this side. That to there. That to there. And we'll go in here. Um, also, a question, guys. Um, oh, my God. What's that about? Why? <sighs> like, uh, why? Why? I hate you. <laughs> um, if, yeah, question, guys. If you want, do you fancy me bringing, not yet, like, I don't know when. Oh, this fence great. Yeah, we'll use this. Um, I really hate that. Maybe that will sort itself out when I am. Um, sorry, I'm losing track of what I'm saying. Um, yeah, maybe I'll. That will sort itself out once I've came back to it. But would you guys be interested in me having a little play? Oh, it's fixed. Little playthrough of Planet Zoo. I don't know how you guys would feel about doing a Planet Zoo kind of playthrough. Um. It's up to you. I might not. I might even edit this out. But we'll see. <laughs> we'll see. I'm, I'm already doing too much. We can't do too much at once because I get confused. I get confused. Now, they don't look half bad with it, but I'm thinking maybe going a bit more solid with a stone that I used to death. Oh, they could work. Um, oh, I prefer them looking a little bit battered, to be honest. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Same in the church as well. This is a medieval church. I want it to look it as well, sweetie. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, cool. Okay. 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 Let's choose a door. Let's choose a cheeky door. We'll put this all the way through here as well. I'm going to put this archway on the inside here. Lovely. Um, yeah, that's pretty. Pretty full. And then a nice door. I don't think we get a too wide arched door. If I'm remembering rightly. They're all three. So is the one from the vampire stuff. Oh, the new one. Oh, oh, look at that. That looks smashing through that arch, doesn't it? Oh, yes. Oh, I'm feeling that, I tell you. I'm feeling it. Yeah, no, this is cool. I'm kind of happy with this. Obviously, details need to be added, but I think that's where we're going to leave today's episode anyway. Um, I'll try and get another episode out this coming Sunday. If not, the episode will be coming out on the Monday. Uh, it depends on how much time I get to film it, etc, etc. But we've made a start. It's not looking great just yet for me. Um, there's things that need to be tweaked and stuff. And details need to be added to the front here. I've left these bare on purpose because I want to put some like statue heads and stuff on them, I think. Um, but so far, I'm kind of semi-pleased with it. I am. But yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching this episode today. Thank you for sticking with me for this series as well. I promise it will be coming back to the screens as per normal. But other than that, I will see you all in the next part. Bye, everybody.